All right. All right. We are live. Am I live? Am I a live fish right now? Are we, are we live? Yeah, I'm gonna check. Yep. My, I'm gonna check my phone. All right. Yeah, so. Yeah. Great. All right. So welcome back to Dual Cubes. Uh, it's been a few days. <laughs> I look, I look at my phone. It's like. Congratulations, you have one new follower in the last month. What? <laughs> one new follower? Uh, anyway, this, this is Duo Cubes. Uh, I've updated the game a bit since last time. I cannot tell you what exactly that's new. Apart from that the boss is definitely different. Um, but yeah, I, yeah I, I don't remember what version we were at when I we first tried this. I believe it was maybe even the first version. So I've updated this a lot. And so yeah, we're just gonna Xbox is just gonna be playing the game for for a bit here, and uh, hopefully yeah. the game doesn't break. Yeah. Otherwise, we will be this queue right now. Which, uh, if you look at the text, uh, yeah, it's just dummy. Dummy. Yes. Yeah. Ooh, test testing explosion. Dummy. Mine on this thing. This oh, awesome. mine. I think there was a mine here. There was like an explosion here. <laughs> First bug encountered. Nice. I don't know why. Yeah, I don't know. Did you not step on it? Nope. Instantly when I spawned in, there was an explosion Damn. right on the kibosh. Yeah, that sucks. Yeah, these mines I have added recently. Uh, I'm not sure if I always want to have these mines in every dungeon, and always, because they're kind of annoying. But uh, yeah, they make the room not so. Easy. Easy. Yeah. Not so easy. Take it easy. Take it easy. Oh, nice. I got a racket launcher for this stupid, annoying, tiny dude. Well, how long is the actual shot delay until you can shoot again? Hold down left click. Oh, Mamma mia, pizzeria. That's a longer delay. Oh, it is a long delay. Shit. <laughs> Whatever, people don't understand, it's a rocket launcher. Yeah. Needs time to think about it. Yeah. Oh, cool. Mine sandwich? I guess it's because the, the ray... The ray that it, um... Uh... Shot down, landed on the side of that hitbox. And so then when it came time to go down... Uh... I don't know why, actually, I don't know why it would rotate. It would just stay the same. Like, they might become a sandwich and still say that. I, I thought they would still have the same rotation. I guess not. I don't, I don't know what. That, wasn't, that one is sideways. How is it sideways? Is it because they have gravity? I, I, they shouldn't have gravity because they should just be teleported to the ground. Actually, I don't know. I'll have to look when it happens to see how it actually that occurs. If I activate. I mean, I. I believe it should have a lower hitbox, or not lower, but like, you should be able to, like, you see where it's flat? You should be able to go closer to it, when it where it's flat, depending, or compared to when it, where, there's, where it's round. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> but the cool thing is, uh, it should be really easy uh, to give friendly mines also. Oh yeah. Look at the friendly mines, they should be really easy. I can just have a proximity mine launcher. Just replace the rocket explosion with a uh, mine. So like when it explodes, it, a mine comes out and then I just gotta change up so the mine can be an ally or a, f a foe. And so if it's an ally, it detects for uh, collisions with enemies. Oh yeah. Oh gambling? Is he there? Is he there? <laughs> Imagine you got it affected. Oh, it, it affected multi shot. <laughs> you just shot and it did nothing. Wow. This next shot is not gonna do anything. Also, or no, the next one, next one, next one, next one. Why? <laughs> did I get a bad thing? Yeah, you got you got bad. Oh. I yeah. saw the heart, and I was like, "Ooh, no, heart, heart!" Yeah, but yeah, but yeah, but the heart broke. It was no, a broken heart. heart. Broke. Dang it! A broken heart. Dang it! Wow! 
It's like it gets jammed. Yeah. The rocket launcher gets jammed. Even though it shouldn't get jammed because it has less bullets in it. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh wait, was this the boss room? Yep. Oh, you're about. To... Why are you using the rocket launcher to get rid of his armor? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> he has armor. <laughs> now you should use rocket launcher. Now it would be fine. That's a pretty big explosion. Yeah. Alright, get hyped. It's boss time. Oh yeah. Purified pure salt water. Refill ammo. Why is he why is he why is he awake? Why is he awake? Whatever, it's fine. Maybe that's like a first run type issue it happens. It seems to always happen on the first run. Why is why is that circle why is that circle so fucking big? <laughs> Whoa, it's going crazy. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Oh 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 so, person cheap. Oh 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 yeah. Not the highest quality. Dude, this is so... <laughs> <laughs> I only want free range viewers. Yeah. Is he... Okay, he's gonna move. Good. I don't know. Why is he moving so high up? Why, why, why is he so high up? Move down! I can't even aim that high almost. Why is he, <laughs> why is he so high up? Oh my god, okay, whoa. okay, whoa. okay, I guess he, I whoa. get. whoa, <laughs> I guess he just was on a co heavy cooldown. Guess I'm reloading, there we go, what the heck, oh, he laid mines? Mm-hmm. Oh, wow, and a dude, two dudes. Yup. That's really cool. Drop stuff. Oh, yet again. Oh, infinite farming. Infinite try try run farming. Nice. Yeah, but you have this dude flying around. <laughs> yeah, I guess. <laughs> Do the the eyeballs eye of Cthulhu spawn drop money? Uh, no. Okay. Yeah, you gotta kill this guy to make the thing ha appear. Cool. <laughs> Wait, also, did you notice the mines? Yeah. Well, where are they? Yeah, where are they? All the mines when all bosses are defeated explode. Oh, got green emerald? Yep. Dude. Yep, Knuckles green. is going to be so jealous. Oh, yeah. That's in the floor. Um. Um. Why? <laughs> well uh, then. Okay, press P. I pressed H. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> you have a line on you. Oh yeah. Cool. Dang it, dude! You know what, you, you can go to the shop. Just press H. Can I? Alright, oh, you can, because the fucking thing triggers it! Oh! <laughs> oh, Emperor Ditto. Hello. Hello! My name is Mark. Uh, hello. I would go into 
of the project and fix this real quick. I don't why I literally fixed it last time. When the thing spawns, it will shoot straight down until it collides with something, and then it will teleport to that. Oh my goodness, what the heck? No mines over there? Oh yeah, oh oh dude, if if a room has no mines, that means it's a shop. Pro tip. Pro tip. Or just empty. <laughs> Honestly, that's fine. Honestly, I I'll, I'll keep that. That's a good thing. That's a cool thing. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Not bad. Two lamp oil bombs, though. Two lamp oil bombs, though. Oh yeah, that's right. Two of them. Two of them. So I did find one slight problem with the game when I played it. It might be fixed, but I'm not sure. When I get a certain amount of items, I can't drop items. Yep, that's fixed. That's fixed. Yep. Uh, it, the issue was, when you go to drop an item, it was checking the inventory slot you've selected. So you see in the bottom left where it tells you an item you've selected from your inventory? Whenever you want to drop an item from your hotbar, it's, it checks that slot in the selected. And if that item that it selects in the bottom left is not anywhere in the hotbar, you can't drop. Uh, so that's how it works. So like, let's say, like you see all the items my friend has right here. If He has shoot selected, which is in his hotbar. Or actually it's not. Or yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. He's holding shoot. So if he were to drop, say, the green thing he has, it would let him drop it because shoot is, the, is selected and in his hotbar. However, if he were to select an item that's not in his hotbar and then try to drop the green thing, it wouldn't let him. But now that's fixed. I also added it so if you hold tab and then Q, it'll just drop the thing you've selected in the bottom left. How do I change items in the inventory? It, it says in the controls on the, in the at the start, but it's a Z and X. How do I change? Items in the inventory because for some reason I can pick up infinite items. Well, yeah, there's no limit. Yeah, there's no limit to how many items you can have. There's not even like a stack limit. The only stack limit there is is for guns. Guns cannot have more than one stack size. I mean, they technically can, I think, but the code is not optimized for that. The code doesn't doesn't really work. So it's not like Minecraft where if you cheat. In so tools can have stack size, it actually works properly, it doesn't really work here. So, yeah, if the items is, is, is fine, uh, for now, um, but I think I believe most issues should be fixed now. Some issues are just things that might be weird, anyway. Go to the boss, I want to see you kill it again. Yep, also, ditto, yeah, we have, yeah, I had landmines. <laughs> Also, Ditto, what version do you have downloaded? Like, what was the last version you played? Because it should it should tell you a version like V O twenty V O fifteen or something. I'm just curious what version you were on. I will check just now. All right. Also, sorry I haven't been live. I have been like chronically busy, uh, addicted to this. Uh, <laughs> like I've I've gone like eight hours almost every day. I, I don't really have time to do other stuff. I I haven't even. I wanted to make a video like two weeks ago. Haven't done that. Uh, but I have been planning, and I think I have an idea on how I want to make the next video. So maybe, hopefully, I'll get that to that soon. They just shoot the floor. Honestly, <laughs> or you can shoot up. Yep. I, I, the the rocket launcher is the best weapon against those flying dudes. <laughs> especially when, ooh, uh, especially uh. when when it uh, has negative multi shot. That's really cool. Also, whatever you do, they don't never take the common pistol. 
If it's called Common Pistol, don't. Don't. <laughs> yeah. It's Herobrine. <laughs> yeah. You, you will get sucked into the game and you will die. Yeah. Friend. Friend is gonna die. Friend, friend is being bullied. No bully. Friend is gonna no die. Bully. Oh. <laughs> bullied. Ooh. Limestone. Oh. Ow. Oh. <laughs> The big cube landmine. Oh yeah. Oh wow wow. Wow wow. Wow wow. Wow. Wow wow. Yeah, I, I have learned uh so with the new boss, which hopefully we are well yeah we did get to see we, we do get to see the boss at least. Um I have since I've learned more about the Vector 3 and what it actually means and other, other, a couple other features now I can make more cooler boss fights and I gotta say I, I really like to use vector 3s they're really cool um, exactly what I needed to do some things also slurp to make the now there was one weird thing there was like a, a slurp thing where to make like you, it rotates around the center I couldn't get it to work so I just copied the other curve path from the mortar shots to make it the boss move sort of like that, like he, how he does. I've heard it. Vector three is like Minecraft coordinates. If you do like TP tilde five tilde zero tilde zero, it like it like would teleport you five blocks to the left or something. It's like re really good. Also, in the version that I did play, I could still shoot when I died. Oh yeah, you can still do that. That's always a thing. Still. So. I also took like shit ton of damage even after I respawned. Oh yeah, that's because if you if that that's that's because of one of the dangerous materials. One of the dangerous materials does quite a devious thing. <laughs> but uh, after a while, you should be fine. You, sh you should stop. Uh, but but what version were you on? Uh, like, look at the folder. Does, does it say V twenty three V sixteen? Because that would help if I knew. I'm turning my PC on now. So yeah, yeah, Vector 3 yeah, is essentially that. Um, and so if, you were, if you're making a 2D game, I believe you will be using it Vector 2, because then it's only X and Y. So like, a, an example of a cool thing you can do with Vector 3 is, is, how I usually did it is, I had an object in a position, and then I had Let's say the boss. And if I want the boss to go to that uh, specific position, I would just put that game object there and then I would have the boss lerp his position to that position. Lerp is essentially smoothen. While I could just transform its position by transform.position equals the, that object's position, the goal. It's better if you use lerp because then you can make it like not go instantly. Uh, it's a bit confusing, uh, but it's fine. Um, so, the way I've done it, so what you can do with Vector 3 is you can get the objects. Whoa. <laughs> the fuck? Yeah, the, the cool whip seems to be pretty good. What what burn does it apply? Um, How much burn does it apply? What was that? I have no idea. <laughs> does it apply dangerous material burn? <laughs> Uh, so, yeah, you get the, you get the object's position where I want to move the object, and then with the vector three, you can randomize the va values and add it to the object's position. So then, the object that I want to move, objects m moves not to the exact position, but a random area around it, which is really cool to make it uh, to make the game more dynamic. Anyway, oh, well, by the way, I found an exploit. You know how once of the things you can do is teleport back to a shop area. 
I think hate or something. Well, it resets the shop so I can get infinite money and any items I want. Infinite money? How would you get infinite money? Um, just buying stuff from the well, shop. Well, yeah, I know stuff. that. But the shop doesn't give you money if unless you trade. Also, the shop is kind of crazy. Um, and yeah, hate is still a thing. But... <laughs> so... I'm just gonna... Hold on, shoot them once with the fire. Yes. A thousand? Yep. Why doesn't it apply? Oh, right, he's ice. These are ice and fire, right? Oh, yeah. But why does the whip do a thousand burn? <laughs> Whatever, it's fine. It's really cool. Cool whip. Cool whip. Hot whip. Oh, no, he's immune to the fire. No. What will I do? It resets the shop. Remember, the trades are random, so I can get trade where I can give one common material. I think like a shit ton of best material. Yeah, that's just the way it's gonna be for now. You're not intended. Like, I would say using H is cheating. It's it's more of a development build type thing. It's more more because it's like the game is unfinished. So if you know about if you do know about it, then like have fun with it. But if you want to play the game legit, then uh, don't do that. <laughs> Because I will be removing that feature at some point. Definitely, yeah. yeah, definitely in the final version. Mustard Myers is yo? No way, dude. Ooh. Yeah, so sorry. <laughs> if you've had any, if you've paid literally 1% attention to my channel, I have not been streaming like ever recently. <laughs> but we're, I, 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 I figured, yeah, I gotta do something. So I, I went on today. Because, uh, I've been working way too much on my game. It's been a minute. It's been a minute, y'all. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. How how many was the maximum mines per room? Ten. Maximum mines per room is whatever the game wants it to be. Oh. That the, the maximum nine mines per room is how unlucky you are. Okay. Um. I guess it would be 9 times 10. The maximum amount... Actually, is, is that 9? Is it 9 times 10? Would it be... Maximum amount would be 90? But of course, every mine doesn't spawn. Because there's a chance. There's a... 65% a chance of it spawning? Or was there a 35% chance? 35% chance of it spawning. So... Yeah. On average, you're probably gonna get like... 25 mines? I think on average 25 20 somewhere in the ballpark of 20 and 35 hmm. I I can guess what you were doing either having an exam or something like that or working on this game Yeah, I, yeah, <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know if you heard it earlier, but I have been chronically addicted to uh, Developing this game and I'm so slow. I am so slow, dude. I Mean I, I am adding stuff slowly, but surely it's just I'm so but slow. Yeah, and that's also also answers your question, Mustard Meyer. I I've been just developing the game. Like, I wanted to make an edited video on this game, which I I am gonna do that. Um. At some point, it's just right now, I kind of need a break from uh, making videos because I want to stream a little bit, and I'll, but I also mostly want to focus on my game. Like, like YouTube was like a side goal that's cool well I'm, I'm, I'm glad you think that because I certainly think it's very cool but hang on so you still haven't been able to go to the shop area have you nope okay so I might have to actually fix this <laughs> <laughs> nah you're not gonna hit him so <laughs> should I should I go into detail how this guy works uh, yeah. Uh, okay, so... Where's the cube? Yeah, the cube is still not here, huh? Yep. Look up. Yeah, okay, that's... Yeah, it's it's bugged. So what are all the new item? I think the cool whip is new. I don't know how long... I don't know how long the cool whip has been in the game, but Ditto, can you tell me what version did you play? 
Uh, what, 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 was I, what was I saying before? Right. Oh, oh. I've been working on this game a lot. And then I... I haven't been doing as much streaming. The videos. I will get around to making a video soon. On this, hopefully. Once I've figured out how I want to edit it. Um, but it should be pretty cool. I hope. Okay. Yeah. Uh, um. So if you can tell me what version you played on, Ditto, I can tell you. I can let you know what the new items are. So, I, I, I'm having fun making this. It's it's just I'm I'm make I'm doing it very slowly. Um. Like I had a lot of trouble make I like I spent a lot of time just working on the boss alone. And it's only one boss also. <laughs> <laughs> but it should hopefully make me make it a little bit easier to make the other bosses. I, sh I should just be able to copy this the boss script I have right now, but adjust it to the new boss. I just found my house out of my bag. Mouse, not house. <laughs> what? Uh, yeah, but I, I, I if you wanna, I, 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 I mind you just move. <laughs> probably, it, it must have mind if you're still here and you wanna play the game. If you feel like you you would wanna try the game, um, you can go to my itch.io page. Uh, it's a dual Kerbo. or just search for the game on itch.io dual cubes. You should be able to find it. And I, I will probably be constantly updating that. So if I'm not streaming, if I'm not streaming, then if you want, you can just check my itch.io page if I've updated the game. And so if I've updated the game, that's probably why I'm not streaming. <laughs> <laughs> like, I can't guarantee I'll keep working this forever, but I mean, I, hopefully I will. I'm, I will try. I'm gonna, like, Oh yeah, I was talking about like YouTube was like a, was I think I wanted to do because it, it wasn't too hard to make YouTube videos. It's still hard, don't get me wrong. Uh, but it was a it, it was a bit of fun. It took quite a bit of work, but I could get like a video done within like five hours on average or, or three. <laughs> yeah, okay, no problem. That's great. I'm, I'm, I'm happy you want to check out the game. Um. So, but, but like, main goal has always been, or main dream has always been, to make a game. I, I don't know if YouTube is my strong suit. Whilst I do have, whilst I am, you know, some, oh, that's good. Oh, uh, that's not, that's not bugged. Oh, is your game bugged? Why is it bugged? <laughs> I don't know. How do I check what version it is, Lama? Go to the folder. Go to the because uh, you have to go to the folder to even launch the game. So, um, look at the folder name. What's the folder name of the or, or or not the folder name, but the exe? Well, actually, yeah, the folder name. Yeah, the folder name. Folder name. Um. So, um. Yeah, you, you, I, I, I don't know. There's a lot to learn about YouTube video making. Uh, why is it bugged? I don't know. Maybe there is a bug. <laughs> <laughs> I have it pinned to my desktop. Wow. Okay, well, shouldn't there be a... Shouldn't there be a folder? Okay, hold up. One more time, boss. It has to work now, right? Oh, yeah, it has to work. Now, what I'm asking, I, I, I'm just wondering, like, what broke? I, I have no idea of telling what broke, because usually most of the time, uh, well, when you're in the build, it doesn't tell you where the error is. And you, it's hard to find and replicate it in um, a normal, yeah, in when, when you're playtesting. And also some issues that are hard to know why they're happening are not even bugs. It's like the code is working fine, but it's just not working in the way I wanted it to for some reason. 
I was thinking about making when he does that shockwave thing to also have it have a like damage explosion hitbox, but I thought like then he could just run into you and he does like a hundred damage to you like just out, <laughs> like that. I don't know about that. Yeah. Oh no ammo. It it says twenty twenty one. No, that that's not the version. What the version should say on the dual cubes folder. So you have a fo you downloaded the folder that you extracted. And that is where you go to play the game. So on that folder, it should say dual cubes V and whatever, like V023. This right here that he's playing is version is a dual cubes V26 or V026. Bruh. <laughs> Bruh. 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 And it was good. That's really good. That's really cool. That's just what I wanted. Hang on, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, it's black on the stream. Yeah, that's fine. Yep. No, not possible, bro. No, not possible. What? Yes, possible. Well, I should be able to... Yeah. Oh, I got the legendary true stick. I should be able to just show this for now. No, not possible, no, just no, okay. Oh, the money isn't going to me. What, the, the thing? Yeah. Is the thing running away from you? No, the money, the gemstones, they're just floating. Oh, right next yeah, that's a side effect of game bugged, I believe. Possibly huh. copium. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, I can control the tilt of the gemstone. No way. Oh, yeah. Hang on, 032. Uh, let's... let's go to notes. Zero thirty-two. We're on zero. Yeah, let's go to zero thirty-one. Okay. I need to know for any What makes? <laughs> um. Well, you need to know for educational purposes. Now I don't know why you're asking me this. Like, I, I, I don't see why I would know this. Um, I don't know why you're looking at me like that. <laughs> um, but what makes a person grey is... Uh, I'm not going to say that. Because I, I don't know. I don't have the, in I don't have the in informations. Sorry. Yeah. I do not have sufficient informations. Unfortunately... I I uh I plead the fifth. Yep. And uh, yeah. Okay, so time to, for the game to tell me what's wrong. You must know. You must know. You must know. Well, to be fair, no one no one really told me in school, so. They also didn't teach me how to do taxes in school. Yeah. Kinda hate them for that. My school did teach me for like one lesson. Of course, we don't, I don't remember what that one lesson had, but... Wow. There was like one lesson where they were like, Okay, here's how to be an adult. One oh, lesson! Lesson over. Lesson over! Yep. Here's how to be an adult, you don't. Yep. Whoa. Why does it do that? I wonder if I should I stream me in the in the editor? I have no lawyer. I don't know what the fifth is. 
Wait, I haven't updated the game or anything, so I probably have an old version. Yeah, but like, can you look on the folder? Like, where did you launch the game? <laughs> go to your download. Okay, okay, ditto. Listen, uh, go to your downloads, right? And then in your downloads folder, there will be a dual cubes folder, probably, because you downloaded the game, right? No, you just got it straight to your house by Amazon, like, or what? Um, <laughs> so. You check the folder, and then look for the name Dual Cubes, and then if there, and then read the name. What what is the name of the folder that the Dual Cubes is from? And so can I, if I do. Wait, no, 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 I need, I need... Oh, this doesn't work either. Do to editor. Yo, on a totally early note, who wants to go on a quest to figure out grayness? <laughs> um, yeah. I mean, I mean that's a quest. Whoa. Is it like a? Is it like a like a like, like a treasure hunt? I mean, it's not like a your classic treasure hunt because, well, it could be more than one thing. It could be more than one result. You know? Yeah. So, normally, when there's a when there's a answer or the or a goal, you know, X marks a spot. There would only be one spot. So, yeah. I don't know how you're supposed to find it, really, if I gotta be honest. How are you going to find it? Okay, why does that, why does that not work? It's like an easter egg hunt, each one is different. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, and, and some, of, some of the eggs are like... Rotten. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, jeez. Uh... What? What do you mean? Space. That does not really help my cause. Oh, ten ones are okay. The only thing I can find is when I download it, it, it which is May fifteenth. Doesn't really tell me anything. But May fifteenth, like I mean, it was the first. I think it was the first. How do you not find it? What does the folder say? Like, can you, can you, like? Can you just tell me what the dual cubes for? Like you know, like maybe it, uh, the first one didn't have a number on it. Does it not have a number? Does it not have a number? Because you should still have a folder that says dual cubes no matter what. And if that's the folder where you're running an exe from, like wh like what are you clicking to run the game? 
if you have a hot if you have a shortcut on your desktop can you check what the shortcut leads to so I'm gonna let's see here window capture Window capture. Why, why can't I preview it? Why can't I preview it? Why doesn't it work? Why doesn't it work? Okay, so there we go. Actually, that, that kind of works. It's pretty good. Yeah. So I, I, I can show in the editor um, what it looks like. Now, let's see. Yeah, yeah. R right now, this is the editor. Uh, I'm trying to figure out why this boss guy doesn't despawn at the start at the start and he like goes to zero for some reason like he just he just moves out of the room for some reason uh so that's a bit weird i, gu I guess i could go to door uh boss of room of boss so yeah, here, here you get a bit of behind the scenes in the editor on how shit my code is. And now you don't get, really get to see my code. But you do get to see how bad it's all put together. I have the option to share it. Maybe you can somehow find it if I knew how to send it to you. Wow, so not boring. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Did <laughs> Did I? Just tell me, how can you not find- Okay, uh, okay. Did you delete it? Can you still run the game? Like, you can still launch it, right? Go to where you launch the game. Where do you launch the game? Like, how are you playing the game if you can't launch it from the folder? Where do you point it for? Like, why would he- Why would it be- Maybe I turn go to player on by default like instantly. Maybe I start with go to player. No, that did not work at all. Interesting. Yep, yeah, it certainly is interesting. Wow. Well, yeah. But why does it go to zero? Stop going to zero. Zero. Why does it go to zero? Don't go to zero. Don't go to zero. How about if new pulse? Master Mario will be back soon. How long do you think you'll be streaming here? I assume the thing called is unityplayer.dll, is it? Yeah, I'll be back soon. How long do you think you'll be streaming? Uh maybe two to three hours I, I i will get this updated i'll get this fixed upload it and then uh we might be doing other games we might do other games today so yeah probably two or three hours at least if i had to make a guess i keep forgetting if i add to something it makes a, a link unityplayer.dll is there yeah. okay uh, I wonder uh, what... <laughs> I wonder what that link. I'm probably just a redirection. Yeah. Either nothing or redirection like sales site. Yeah. Some people upload links to like file directories, and that that doesn't work. Like you can't. Like some guy was reviewing like speedrun footage, right? And people were yeah. instead of uploading the footage, they were just copying the file directory to the video. 
<laughs> the file directory. As if, like, they can just access your computer. Like, come on. <laughs> yeah. Um, anyway, um, you know, what folder is the DLL in? Check the name of the folder that the Unity player DLL is in. If new pulse equals new vector 3, 0, 0, 0, go to player. <laughs> At least the cool whip can like instantly kill the testing dummy. <laughs> I just got the super cool. Oh, so... can it? <laughs> yep. Wait, how? How much damage does it do? Hang on. It was like a thousand five hundred per. Frame. Hold on, hold on. Press P. Press P. Press P. Right. I press P. Uh, well, first I have to remove. Oh, the armor. <laughs> Okay, dummies, what? The thing is named Unity Player. Yeah, but what's the folder? What folder is that thing in? Like, the Unity Player is a file on your computer. What folder is it in? Like, things are usually sorted into folders, and I, this one I know is in a folder. So what Honestly, uh, this would be the only situation where copying the file directly <laughs> and, and posting it to us would, would help. Because we would see the folder name. Yeah. It's in the folder called dual, cu dual cubes. Okay. Yeah. 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 That's my suspicion. There is no number. This is the first version you have. Right? Yeah, it's the first version. So there's a lot of things that are fixed and added. If you want to check out what the new, all the new things are, go to my HIO page. I have. Oh my god. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> yep. That's some hot fire. Okay. If you want to check. The updates, uh, all the new items, uh, you know, go to my posts on Dual Cubes. You also probably want to download the latest version. Um, I'll post a link to it. So you're telling me know. I wasted my time to find that? No, Dual Cube is that? No. That's the first version. That's the folder was called. You didn't waste your time. The, the friends we made along the way. <laughs> that was the time that we wasted. So that, that, that's my page on HIO. And if you scroll down, you can see development log. And that's, you, that's where you can check all of the updates that I added. Yeah. Oh, wow. Even like, uh, there's even like a neat list. Like if you click on, wow, that's really cool. Dual cubes available, dual cubes fixes and additions, dual cubes, dual cubes, dual cubes, dual cubes, dual cubes, dual cubes, yeah. stuff updates. It, it, it's like a, a really, really well done Kickstarter page. What do you it's mean? like developer updates. Yeah. Yeah, is telling the, the, the backers. Do I, need a, do I need a mouse for this game? Well, I mean, you can do a uh, can I beat this game with no mouse challenge. You can do that. Oh, yeah. Let's try that. Probably not possible. Because uh, you need to click to shoot. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> and there is no rebinding, is there? Mm. Well, I could do it outside in software, maybe. Maybe? Maybe. Actually, there are keyboard. I do have a keyboard, actually, that is that does have a left mouse click button. Because it's uh, one of those uh, small portable ones uh, for, for, like, couch, couch uh, TV watching. Uh, like smart TV stuff, and it's uh, it has a trackpad and a yeah. left click button. I also don't have the game on Steam. Uh, I did look into how to upload games to Steam, and it's quite interesting. Um, it, it's a little confusing, but I believe I um, I know how uh, how I could do it. Uh, but I won't be uploading it to Steam until a while. Uh, I I also I don't know. I might look into adding controller support. Is the thing is. Now that I play on uh, Super version, version 26 is the latest, yeah it is, um, although you need money to upload Steam, yeah I'm, I, I, I can afford uploading to Steam unless it's like 10k, I don't know how much it is, actually it is, I think it's like 100 euros from what I've heard, I'm not certain about that, that's just what I've heard, um, but yeah that's fine, because after I've uploaded Steam I should be able to upload it, uh, update it for free, I think, copium, um, yeah. 
Yeah, I don't know when I'll add controller support because now that I play on PC, mainly I, I don't really play on the controller that much, except for you know Nintendo Switch. Um, some games I've used controller for. Um, but yeah, I, I I'll try and add controller support at some point, um, which would be cool. What the heck? Oh my goodness! They are the yeah. things are locking onto the boss. I think. Yeah, they are. So it even spawned in right now. Even does that? Hmm. Okay, I need to. Mm. What if I were to kill the boss and then die? Come back here. Do you think the thing would spawn here somewhere? I don't. You can check. The only game I'll use controller for is GTA 5 because I only played with controller for that game. Sadly, I lost my Xbox that had GTA 5 on it. No! No! I think I used controller for like Fall Guys when I played on PC. Fall Guys controller yeah. is pretty cool. And, uh,. You, you said you might want to play it at some point on stream, right? Yeah. If I'm not mistaken. Yep. And, uh, yeah. And, yeah, there's been a lot of cool stuff they've added to that game. Unfortunately, as with many games, I haven't had time to play it because I've been doing so many other things. I would, I, like, the list of priorities have been too much. Like, there's a lot of games that are, that are on the, like, I really want to play them right now. And... Even though, like, I would say Fall Guys is on that list, there are so many things above it, still, that are yeah. of stuff I really want to do. Well, well, I'll see you guys later. Yeah, have, have a good, day. have a great day, Meyer Mustard. Uh, let's do this. Public bool. Start up. Of course. Just to. Float. Oh, I didn't die. Dang it. It was too bad. Bugger. 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 Bummer. That should work. Oh, also, I moved my PC to my room, and I'm not using a cable or whatever it's called to connect to the Wi-Fi. So I run really slow in games now. Oh yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Yikes. Yeah. That, that that cable you need is called an Ethernet cable, yep. and uh, they yeah you need those. Um, yep. I don't think I'm using one right now, but at my old Wait. apartment, I. Uh, I really, I really desperately needed that to even have a chance at running. Like it was already like, if I was wasn't using internet was running one hundred times slower than it was when I lived at my dad's place. <laughs> and if I was using Ethernet, it was running like fifty times slower only. <laughs> I had a short one. Yeah, my Ethernet cable that I had was decently long. <laughs> yeah, you want to compare Ethernet cable sizes? Good. Good. I mean, uh, I think what? mine would be because um, <laughs> it's like the span of two rooms <laughs> because the if the router is in the hallway and I'm in the bedroom and the, the PC is at the very far end. And, and actually recently the dude actually did come uh, to the, the the groundskeeper did come here, and uh, he drilled a hole in the wall, so now I can actually close my door without destroying the Ethernet cable, which is cool. What? Okay, great. Why is this not working? What? What is this? My my Wi-Fi router is in the living room, right? By the table, and I had the PC there. Ah, oh, dang. Dang. 
Why is it not? What? Why? What? What? It's not these. It's the thing that makes the door locker turn off the boss is just not happening. Hmm. What if you, for future endeavors, add a a hot a a hotkey shortcut to like add the bridges for in the future in case stuff like this happens again and we need to like test more for other things or yeah, stream for other things i guess collider dot get component full script developer art is this setting it to false i wonder hang on so the boss is it always this and the boss No more help for you. We now dives. Because the cube is not spawned. The cube. I don't even think the cube spawns. Yeah, the cube isn't even like spawned. Ever. Boss alive is not true. What? Uh, yeah, I have a pizza in front of me. I need to eat it. Okay, cool. <laughs> Wait, do you? I don't thought you. Th I thought you threw that was at the computer screen. <laughs> I like the new boss. It looks interesting. Nice. That's good. That's good. Yeah. Wait, how much ammo do you have? Or is it Unsmaka? Uh, Unsmaka is playing. He has nine, 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 nine ammo. It's infinite ammo. I mean, I could just add a function that says it has infinite ammo. Uh, but, yeah, that's not this right, this right. However, the, the portal, the dungeon portal is not being spawned. Dungeon boss portal. So this is the one. Boss portal. Enemy level up. So that's just right there. Okay, okay delete that. And now we go to the boss. Sorry, uh, um, sorry if not a whole lot is happening on the stream. Uh, I am testing the. I'm trying to fix this issue so we can actually beat the boss and move on to the next level. <laughs> so now, if the boss gets game ended, yeah, the cube is just not here. The thing is ne never spawned. But why? Add a cheat code thing for real for real. You can find cheat codes hitting somewhere random. Say one is in the furthest corner of the, the boss room. Or maybe what could be even be back of the on the back of an enemy. <laughs> maybe again doesn't recognize the boss as a boss. Well the th crazy thing is it was working like fine before. It was working fully alright. And it, it, everything was in order. And just now it suddenly doesn't work. Like it literally works in version 25? Or maybe not. In version 24 or 23, I believe it works. It worked. 
If Kaleidos up can come upon a portal script, Kaleidos I had a game of the False. If Kaleidos don't get upon a boss stuff. Oh! Oh, I'm such an idiot! Okay, so I figured it out. The boss has a script called boss stuff. And this, this doesn't do what you think it does, but this is just a script I've added to it. So other scripts can easily find the boss. So if I have to like scan, let's say every enemy, I can check what enemies have the boss stuff script. Now in this case, it's only one. Uh, but if I scan all the enemies and it has boss stuff script, then that room knows there's a boss there. And I, I recently repurposed the boss stuff script to check to, uh, Make it so it adds itself to a list, and after it adds itself to a list, it destroys the script. So that boss doesn't have the boss stuff script anymore, and that's why it's not de being detected as a boss. So that, so yeah, it actually was not being detected as a boss because it was removed. Wow. From the loud, ooh, I assume you figured it out. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so what I need to do is, I need to make a bool public bool triggered equals false and then and then triggered equals false and then trigger will be true after this all right all right okay there you go boom did it oh yeah also pizza is has been eaten already pizza has been destroyed yep of course i am a professional eater of worlds Eater of pizzas. That's <laughs> what you mean. Eater of pizzas. You just really... Whenever there's a pizza in 500 meters from me, I just start, I just make that <laughs> sound. Oh my god, dude! What is that? It's so loud, <laughs> dude! You seem to really like pizzas. Oh yeah. Have you played Pizza Tower? <laughs> nope. But I uh, should probably. But honestly, pizza, it's. Pizza Honest, Tower on, honestly, is... pizza. <laughs> yeah, honestly, pizza. But but seriously, Pizza Tower is a 2D platformer game, and I have uh, had a history of not liking 2D platformers for some reason. I don't know why. But I bought Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze. Oh. I couldn't even. I, I couldn't be bothered finishing it for the longest time because I got bored. Dang, really? I, I don't know. I, I mean, I haven't played any of the Donkey Kong games either, but I do have like a core memory of going to like a local, uh, what would you even call it? Like electricity store? <laughs> yeah. A local, like just media. The electronic giant. <laughs> media market. <laughs> yes, yeah. yes. Yes. Uh, I, yes, honestly, Peter. Um, so, uh, but I have a core cool memory of going to there, and then I remember them having, I believe it was Donkey Kong Country Returns for the Wii on like display, and you could play it. They had like this, they had this weird like, must have been like backrest. What's it called? The is it called backrest? What's it called? Like on the chair, the back part of a chair. What's that? Yeah, the backrest. Yeah. So they had like two like pillars and then like how do I, like two metal bars connected into a like soft cylinder that you could le uh, like have your back on not really sit on but i guess you could sit on it it wasn't too tall up and then there was just wii remotes so you could play it with nunchuck and i remember doing that and i believe that was also the day I, I, I was just there playing it because it was cool I, I i've always thought that Donkey Kong games the 2d ha has looked cool like they always look nice and they don't look too bad for me i haven't played them still but they still look nice and they have they seem to have a good vibe to them honestly um and i remember playing that and i was there with my friend i believe and then i remember mom calling me and he, he, she was like where the fuck are you guys and i'm like <laughs> uh at my friend's place obviously <laughs> and then she found out 
You biked all the way over there? <laughs> we, we had been like going on our bikes for like, I don't even know how long, but it, it is actually pretty far to where I lived. I'm actually surprised I even made it all the way over there at that age. Yeah. I'm like, how the hell did... Like, bro, I, like, I, I can, if I go like 10 meters in the wrong direction, I'm like, where am I? <laughs> Like my my coordination and photographic memory immediately blows up. Yeah. Um, I believe this should work now. Okay. Why the fuck did he just do that? I I still don't know why he does that. Why does he do that? Why does he just like instantly go down at the speed of light? So anyway, I got the, the B-Gun, yep. That's the B-Gun, it's called the Hexagoner. Cool. Very cool name, by the way. Is that the B-Gun? Yeah. Yeah, Hex yep. uh, uh, Hexagoner? Yeah, thank you, I came up with it myself. Because I believe... I believe Anthony Gungeon already has Hexagon? Hexagon, I believe it already has Hexagon. What, like, why does, it, why does it do that? Why does it go immediately down? Does he have, like, what is going down immediately? Is the, the boss. boss. Yeah, the boss. Okay, check this out. So I fixed Does the bug. Have... Look at this. I fixed He's... the issue. I turn him on. Right. Okay. And then we have, yep. I have this timer that needs to count down before he can actually start moving. Yeah. And check this out. On... Boom! And then he goes back and everything's fine. Oh. Yikes. The bun? <laughs> the bun? The bun. The <laughs> bun. Yep, be good. Oh yeah, I need to add breads. Holy shit, I need to add breads. Oh yeah. Uh, is is he going to like a special coordinate? Is that like zero zero zero? He goes to or something? I mean, probably. Because he, he is using vector three, right? Yeah. Yeah, and new position is probably like zero 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 for some reason. something with that maybe i'm not do, do i make like if new position is zero 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 then return because new position should always be moving and if it is zero 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 then just heck off it shouldn't be zero 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 but it could be zero 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 yeah Okay, uh... No ammo! Dang it. Wait. Wait, um... Oh, it doesn't work now. Because... It doesn't work now. Nothing works, because it keeps returning. And oh, it never gets fast. Oh, let me, let me see if I can get around this. Go to player. Okay, if go to player is... False. Uh, if equals that... And and go to player is false. The bun gun. Oh yeah, the bun gun. Bun gun. Dude, I'm gonna, oh dude, I'm gonna add a furnace, and I'm not gonna tell anyone. Well, you're gonna know now. But what if <laughs> I add a furnace, and you can use it to um like cook materials, right? To make them better. Yeah. But what you can also do is put the bun gun in it to make it better. <gasps> oh yeah. And yeah. no and no one will know. Oh yeah. Except us. Bro. No one will believe us. Dude, look at this. Why? Look at this. Alright, it's not on stream. <laughs> it's not on stream. <laughs> My bad. Oh, whatever, it's fine. Uh all, all you have to see was it does it doesn't work anymore. Cool! Okay, so where does... Okay, new position. It turns into the honey bun gun. Yeah. Yeah. Move time is less than one. Yeah. 
less than one. What do you mean less? Why less than one? Oh, never mind. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, hang on. So where is new position calculated? New boss equals target cards. Okay. Um. So what? Okay. Print. Viking five. Oh, the return of the Vikings. Looking smart, is just infinitely killing the same boss. Which will he never? <laughs> will he ever get a rest? Is that what you're doing? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hang on, let's see. Viking. It's not Viking 5. It's not Viking 5. <sighs> what? Is it this? Let's see, is it? Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, uh, I, Ditto, I recommend not downloading version 26. Version 26 is broken because of this. It is very unplayable. Uh, okay, hold on, what was that? Viking 5, I just saw? I'll make sure to uh, upload 27 soon. Okay, so it is Viking 5. Equals target chords. Let's do if target chords isn't equal to new vector three zero zero. Cool idea, Dido. Idea, add the boss's health bar on the top of the screen when you enter the boss room. I downloaded the version like 30 minutes ago or whatever you sent me the link in chat. Uh, yeah, the boss should have its own health bar. I know how to do it. It's just, I'm not too worried about adding it because I do like the health bar just being above the enemy. That's kind of how it, they do it in Pikmin. In every Pikmin game, uh, they never use a health bar for the bosses. Oh yeah. The only health bar that you get to see is this circle, the pie chart, um, which you see for every enemy. So that's how you know the boss the boss's health. You, the, the pie chart might be like bigger for our bosses, but yeah, you just get to see the pie chart, not any numbers. I have no idea how much damage a Pikmin does actually. I just know that a red Pikmin does 1.5 more than other Pikmin. <laughs> now I don't know what, how much 1.5 more is, but yeah, okay, I, I I believe this is fixed. Uh, this should be fixed now. Never mind. What the heck? Yeah. That that was Duel's destruction drink. That's uh, that's 100% uh, multi shot for 30 seconds. <sighs> Weapon coffee is. 50% fire rate for 30 seconds. Why is it moving so fast? Hey, hold on, let me check again. Does he go to zero zero? I'm pretty sure he goes to zero zero. I mean, hey, at, at, at least I'm. Um, you know, I, I guess this is a it's a bit cooler to live stream whatever this is rather than <laughs> just streaming it to my friend. Yeah. This doesn't fully go to zero zero. Hold on. Oh snap! Extraordinary dual rifle. But, oh, actually, no. He definitely is going to. He definitely is intending on going to zero zero. 
It says he doesn't make it in time oh. for it's time to move again. Wait, does the friend or whatever it is called that you summon explode landmines? Yep, they do. They trigger landmines. Oh, they do. Yeah, they do. I didn't even notice that. They are they are friendly, so the mine when it detects a friendly uh, uh, tag, it explodes. Hmm. So anyway, I'll dual rifle, coolest weapon. Uh yeah, yeah it's pretty cool. Pretty cool. It's all right. It's all right. Yeah. Now this should be fixed, but like it's not. It literally checks it. If new if target coordinates is not zero zero zero, then go. But they have to be zero zero zero, because I he's going there. Target cords. So why is new <laughs> new position is zero? Okay, okay, okay. So removing that did not fix it. Okay, hold up. I don't think the landmines are friendly. I tried to hug it and exploded. Sad. This worked to be friends. He's still losing his mind. No, this is just him when he develops game. Yeah, can vouch for that. <laughs> I've got an alibi. Yep. Okay, so if new position is that, why in the flying blue dicks is he not going there? Paste. That's literally where you should go. Why is he not going there? Why are you going down? <laughs> what? What? What am I doing? Why is he not going there? He should... Like, if he is moving at all, which the only way he is moving... Actually, let's test it. If I just remove that, does he move still? Moai is what you sound like for some reason. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, if I remove that, he doesn't move. So the only way he's moving is because of this. Now! Because of that, that means new pulse equals target chords and evaluate new position. FW. Okay. So... Like what? But like what? What? Add. Better be plus add. Yeah, that, that, that. Oh, I'm over healing again. Cool. Better be. Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, the game is broken. So that's understandable. Hang on, if pet W does. How does the pet W when I do this? That's right, Ditto. Pet W is zero? Hang on. Wait, did we to find a health exploit? Yeah. Uh, I mean, I, I, I don't think you actually can. Get the, I don't know how you make this happen, 
but I'm fairly confident is I mean it might not be but I'm pretty sure it's because when something else broke breaks because usually that's always been happening if one thing breaks the rest will follow every time without fail yep okay so bet w is zero oh okay oh i think i know why because it, it, it wants to move so i make the uh, whenever it moves there's always a midpoint similar to the mortar shots and it, it needs to move to a midpoint first and then to the target and the midpoint seems to always want to be zero in this scenario. Yeah! I just cracked the code. Oh yeah. I think I just cracked the code. Bug fix incoming very shortly. Nice. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's just evaluate. What is this? Okay. I believe. Oh yeah. I believe I put this here. Then no, no, no. Where did I put it? Has triggered. Here. I believe I put it here. Thanks for telling me about it, Big Smucker. I mean, you can just get defense. You know. Defense perks. <laughs> if you didn't read the patch notes, you know, which I think you should do, because it has some cool things, um, then you would know that a couple of updates ago, I added defense perks. Okay, uh, this still doesn't work at all. Exciting. <laughs> So that's the midpoint. Why is that that? Wait, yeah, what? 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 Oh, Spaka. Yeah. What do you mean? Oh no. What the heck is this? Maybe I just. Maybe I do this in the start function. Honestly? Maybe if I do this in the start function, we could be cooking. Yeah. I never read. So the duck do I do with the version 1.6, uh, 0 0.26? Uh, you just wait for me to make 27 and, th and then you delete it. <laughs> yep. I never read any game updates. I don't know. I just find what they add. I mean, that is a good way of doing it. Um, however, you might not. You might not find all this. Okay. <laughs> Why? Why not? Oh no! Why is what? What? Okay, interesting. Hmm. Very interesting. Oh, most certainly interesting. New position. Oh, mamma mia! The um, the gemstones push the mines towards you. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of funny. That's something to face, definitely. Of new position. New position doesn't actually... Get adjusted. Until here. So, do I have to freaking... Because it seems the target chords is correct. New pose is not here. 
Exciting. 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 How exciting. 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 Yeah. Alright, is it fixed? Uh, what are the odds that it's fixed now? Uh, two to one. Is that good or bad? I don't know. It's fixed. Oh, yeah. I mean, it moving down instantly and then back up is not like a game breaking thing. Like, oh, the boss spazzed out once. Cool. I mean, it's not like that's ever happened before in a game. Yeah. It's just, it was annoying me. So. I should probably not have the hexagoner right there. Should, should not get that to start every time. Sorry. Sorry if you did want it. That's not how it works. <laughs> And then, is the boss still up here that I need to delete? I don't think so. Okay, I can now create a build. Uh, can we get a prayer that the PC does not explode when I do this? Yeah. Please! Please! Please? Please, I did not intend on doing this uh, stream like all the day. Like I, I like I want to do the stream and uh, on my game, and then I want to stream other games that we can play uh, for a bit, and then I want to keep working on my game later today. Uh, but I don't know. We'll, we'll see what happens. Um, we'll see what happens. Oh yeah. So you still haven't gotten the dungeon to spawn, the dungeon to portal, I meant. The portal has never spawned. Nope. Yeah. I don't think it's ever going to spawn because the boss, the crucial script is not there. And I believe, yeah. I think that's pretty good. Actually, it wasn't causing an error when I was testing it. Cheese? Yeah. Yeah, I think cheese. We've forgotten the cheese crackers. Oh my goodness. I am creating build. Nice. Let's look at how many times have you killed the same boss? Oh, you don't want to know. <laughs> I mean, uh, uh, across oh. my lifetime or just this stream? Oh. 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 Alright, build has been created. Yeah. I'm gonna close out of the game. Editor. Already that broke the game, by the way. Didn't realize the uh, thing. Okay, create a dashboard. Edit. Alright, I, I gotta. I gotta make the file, the, the folder into a zip. Make into zip. Alright, here we go. Get ready for version 27! Oh yeah. Okay, and then... Delete... Warning, this action cannot be undone. <sighs> oh no. Alright, 27 being uploaded right now. Yeah. Uploading? Uploading zip. Uploading. Uploading. Alright, there we go. There it is. Right. Devlog. Where does the stream go now? Okay, it just goes. New devlog. Dual cubes. The boss fix. Version point one point 
The stream has ended. Dang. I am downloading version 27. Hang tight. The stream has not ended. Barry's just started. That was a Transformers reference. Cool. Transformers Armada. Yeah. 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 Good. 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 Yep. Cool. This has been my weekly Transformers Armada appreciation post. Cool. Good job, Unsmaka. Thank you. All right, there we go. Version twenty-seven is up. Um, and I am sharing the screen. Oh, 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 oh it, it just works automatically already. Hey, wait, say something? Yeah, okay. Have say stuff? Yeah, okay, good. It's already here. Nice. Okay. Let's go. Alright, great. Okay, good. What has my Inferno Kilometer Tracker data loot doing in this recycle bin? Why? Oh no. Oh no, game broke. Game broke. Oh no. Oh no! Anyway, hold on, be right back. Yeah, oh, alright. This is now an Ungsmaka stream. Hello, people of the Ungsmaka stream. I have taken over Doodle's channel, and I will make some pretty big changes to this channel. Uh, first off, we're going to play more Dual cu Cubes, because uh, Dual Cubes is the only thing I know how to play now. And in order to do that, we're gonna need to go to the Jio page and download it and since i have already downloaded it i am playing it right now and as you can see here there are landmines everywhere and people on fire and they are fire elementals and they have high defense because he has like defense blocks on him the, the lore is that he he has had a tough upbringing, so he has developed tough skin, that's why he has so much defense. And he he just spawned another dude when I killed him, which is also a very lore heavy thing, because when uh, these things die, sometimes they spawn new dudes, that's the lore. And when they do that, uh, those dudes could also spawn other dudes, which uh, is also part of the lore, the overarching lore story in this it's very deep and intensive and takes uh, two days to fully comprehend. <laughs> so yeah, and as you can see here, the flying dude, the absolute worst enemy in the game right now, because it will literally go straight through your bullets and not take damage, which is really fun, because that's that's in, okay, in the lore. Okay, what is the uh, What? What? what, what oh, hang on. Uh, what, are you talk, what are you talking about? Oh, nothing. In fact, why is 87 different things doing in it? So if I heard correct, the 027 version is out. Yeah, yeah, you, yep. yeah. You can go download it. It should be fixed. We'll find out shortly when he gets to the boss here. You got a red thing. What is that red thing? Is that defense? Yep. Wall. Wall. Ooh, looks like an arrow. What? <laughs> the gemstone just flung the mine towards <laughs> I guess because the mines are also uh, on on uh, on the first uh, they're on the default layer default as well as the um the coins. Well oh, actually no. The coins should be oh, actually I don't remember how I set up the layering, but um yeah I guess they're on the same as mine. Where's the boss? I don't know.
let's blow these guys up. Here we go. Uh, well, well, you, you, when it is the weird audio click sound, what, what did you say it was called? A chirp? Yeah, that, that happened. Oh. That, that just happened. Dang. Why not a blocks or a cat? <laughs> That's true. I wonder. Nope. What's the what's the, the disc number ten or whatever? The dark one? Not, uh, not, not. thirteen or eleven. No, 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 not the broken one. The oh, the dark one is the star list. Stall, yes, that's the one. Yeah. Yeah, why not, yeah, why not a stall? Yeah. <clears throat> I'm privy to <coughs> Mel Melohi <coughs> myself. <coughs> Melohi? Yep. Cool. Mole is also pretty good. Mole. Oh, yeah. But like, big step. Oh, that's true, big step. This is not where the boss is. Yep. But go to the boss. Now! I'm trying! You need to go to the boss now! Also, thinking about adding a perk that gives all weapons homing. I, I missed this somehow. <laughs> do I, um, or, or do I make it so there's a chance of a weapon becoming ho a shot becoming homing and uh, the perk increases that chance? Oh, yeah. That would be cool. And maybe I do set like a limit of uh, like every perk ha it, it has a stack size limit of five. Yeah. But the thing is, the enemies can get infinitely stronger, but you can't. I guess that's fine. Is it? Oh, Ditto's back. Ditto is back. Ditto, if, do, you, do you got any like general me game mechanics that you would wish that this game works? Like, uh, I, I mean, as in like, how should the enemies get stronger? Or where should you get stronger? Like, how should the perks be used? As an equipable item? Or should they always be active as soon as you pick them up? Like, what are your thoughts? Maybe by enemy that can go invisible. Maybe the player can wall run and jump. You mean wall jump and wall jump? I guess. Enemy that can go invisible. Hmm. <clears throat> 
like eventually i want to be able to add like other characters that you can play as that have their own uh, unique abilities um that all have their different way of playing the game so like this first guy this, this first cube is just this first guy is probably like the canon you know saver of the world yeah but then there will be other other, other that um could take its place in case like this like like if this guy died like in a time now where this guy died um like it, it, it it'll just be oh what if oh you know what would be a really cool detail let's say um uh you played the game for the first time right and then yeah. you have to play the, as the cube for your first run and then when you beat the game and you play it through again um with a different character the lore would be like the first cube was defeated to a like in the cutscene and it'll say defeated to a whatever you died to on your first ever playthrough oh yeah so like that could be pretty cool yeah when i search duo cubes on if you scroll down you will find something called cube cube and it's title screen or whatever is penguin somehow yeah <laughs> You don't have the money. Oh! I don't have the money. Ooh, that's not bad. Is this the boss room? Yep. Alright. Yeah, the, the, the mortar does not hit that flying guy very well. Yeah. I don't know why you would be using like a catapult to hit an airborne target anyway, but if you do hit it, it should be good. I guess they were using catapults for airborne targets before. I don't know. Anyway, boss. So he is not out and about roaming already. Nice. And he should not spaz out when he spawns. Oh, yeah. And the, yeah, the shield is the correct size also. Oh. Oh, I'm almost dead. <laughs> the shield does increase in size though over time. That's just kind of a thing that happened when I set the duration of the... Uh, effect to 999 so if you do manage to be in the fight for 999 seconds without destroying his armor he, that shield will just be away but that's 10 minutes i'm not dying <laughs> yeah okay so i was gonna see how it worked earlier so how it works is oh um Oh, let's see if the thing spawns. The thing should spawn now. But let's see. Wait, isn't it already? No, it's not. That's not it. Oh yeah. yeah! So how he works is, uh, the, he starts off by setting four positions, uh, one in each corner of the the map, or not really in the corner, but like close to the corner, and. In his first, he has three phases. Phase one, he's slow, and uh, the, the amount of time he moves until he has to stand still for a bit is random. Um, but usually in phase one, th those times will be lower than later. Um, and then uh, he, he'll just, and the way he moves is calculated through those four positions that I set. And if he moves too far away from the center, he has to move back to the center. And the the and why it looks so weird where he moves is because he doesn't go exactly to where the four positions are. He randomizes a, within a range of that position, and then he just come, does that over and over again. And I don't think he can go to the same um, point more than once, or not more than once, but like at, uh, like two in a row. So. Motherfucker is the Dodge King boss. <laughs> yeah. Yup. Yup. Come on, let's get a cool whip. Uh, we're, we're gonna play this for a little bit longer, and then uh, like maybe like, like maybe another ten minutes, and then we'll switch. Right, 
that's still look like that. Workshop. Workshop. Bruh. Oh, okay, that's not bad. I should have the new version downloaded. Great. What? <laughs> Did he move the mine? Uh, probably. Let's go and fight the boss one more time, because oh yeah. So I'm, I'm intending on adding a save system soon, hopefully. Uh, maybe not soon, soon, but I definitely want to do that, um, because it could be cool. Um, and the way I'm think the way I'm gonna do it is there I've seen a tutorial that's pretty good. However, like I am kind of a little bit worried about write like creating new files through scripts. Like I feel like oh, that's yeah. a I feel like that's a recipe for disaster. Yeah. Cause I have to I believe I have to create a new file and then I have to put information to it. So do remind me to add like fifty if null statements. <laughs> so it makes sure that everything is in order before it creates a file. Yeah. the boss room so the way I'm doing it is I store in a list because uh, I can't really save I don't think you can save prefabs or objects like uh, like, like a game object in the world to a list in a, in this really um, so what I have to do is I have, I have to store IDs a list of IDs which will be the list of IDs of items you have in your inventory so I'll save an ID for each inventory item you have, right? Yeah. And then I'll store a separate list that stores the stack size of each item. And then all I have to do is just when you launch the game, run a command that gives you all those items. Yeah. And, 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 and everything should just work fine. Uh, also, probably say want to save coins. Oh yeah. Uh, but that's about it. Uh, that's really all I have to save. I mean, may maybe ammo, also, but uh, I don't know. It's not that necessary. I mean, you. Can, I mean, that means you can't just quit out the game and you can refill all your ammo. Oh, we'll see what I do about that. Yeah. Thanks, book is already overpowered. Yep. Does every room have landmines? Uh, yeah, except for the shops. Any room that can spawn enemies has landmines. Alright, do some gambling. Gamba. Do some gamba here. Oh, yeah. What'd you get? Oh, oh, oh. Tower of Hopkins. Draw uranium. Dual rifle. Dangerous potato white. Tower of Hopkins. Or dual rifle. <laughs> yeah, I need to add more extraordinary items, but I also need to yeah. add more like lower tier items as well There's also not very many super rare items. Well, I'll get scammed <laughs> <laughs> Oh one <laughs> Raw lead cool All right, but I think that's it um, Oh yeah, should we call it there for cubes? I think so All right Okay, so that's been dual cubes um, We're gonna go play 
another game now. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna stop the recording. Uh, but I'll still be streaming. Yep. But this will be this is where the recording is gonna stop. So uh, let me get rid of. How do I can? I, how, do I, how do I remove the? There we go. There we go. So yeah, I hope you all, I hope you all enjoyed the show. Um, but yeah, but if you stick around, we're gonna be switching game now. <laughs>